This week, we will read on Wednesday to show solidarity the Christians who have been persecuted for their faith around the world. I'm Stephanie Solomon and you're watching Seven Years. Christmas is just around the corner, which means Christmas carols, Christmas crackers, and of course, the wonder of tinsel. And for us at Jesus House, it also means spreading Christmas cheer, also known as SCC. Now this year, we are going to various stations in London to hand out tea, coffee, festive treats, and of course, share the good news of Jesus Christ. This year, SCC is taking place from Monday the 16th until Friday the 20th of December, from 6 a.m. until 11 a.m. Now we'd love you to come and help us serve at these stations. We'd want you for an hour, two hours, maybe a whole day, if you can give that to us. For more information about how to serve, please visit the link on screen. Hope to see you there. Thank you so much for your donations last Sunday to Christmas Lunch and Jesus. There's still time to donate by sponsoring a £25 hamper, either as an individual or as a group with family and friends. For more information on sponsoring a hamper, please visit the link on screen. Jesus House has partnered with Christians Against Poverty for many years to help with their mission of releasing thousands of families from grinding poverty through debt counselling and community groups. We are thrilled to announce that between the 1st and 9th of August, four families have become debt free. R suffered from domestic violence and used the credit card to finance her rent and support her son. For a time, she was even living on her sister's couch. After much encouragement, she finally sought help to get out of debt. R managed to find a job relatively quickly, but due to the nature of her work, the option of getting out of debt would stop any employer from recruiting her. After much prayer, she spoke with her employer and explained her situation. The employer hired her despite the nature of her debt, and now she's going to be debt free. Let's continue to pray that our partnership with CAT will be strengthened and that God will use us to release many families from the bondage of debt. In Jesus' name, Amen. The Jesus House Prison Ministry is working in conjunction with Prison Fellowship to help run the Angel Tree Project. During this project, we are going to be sending 500 presents to the children of inmates up and down the country, where the inmates have requested for their children to receive gifts. Now, that's more than just the present we're sending. We're actually putting a smile on the faces of these children. And we'd love you to help us during this week. We are starting in the first week of December, starting today, to source, wrap, and send presents out. And we need your help in the following three ways. Sponsorship of the gifts. Each gift costs around £15 plus £5 postage and packaging and we're grateful to receive any amount you can give. Administrators to log the gifts and prepare them for wrapping from the 1st until the 4th of December and also assisting on wrapping days from the 4th to the 6th of December. And finally, wrappers from the 4th to the 6th of December. All the links shared on 7 News are in the weekly JH newsletter that is sent to all members on Saturday night. So open it up and get involved. Living in the United Kingdom, we are so privileged to be able to worship God openly without fear of imprisonment or repercussions. This is not the case in all countries, sadly, where the persecution of Christians is on the increase. On Wednesday the 27th of November, together with other Christian churches and organisations, we made a visible stand for persecuted churches all over the world as we held a short outdoor service, praying for our persecuted brethren around the world. 
this is freedom to be able to stand in a in a forecourt and and say hallelujah and praise god as uh, some dare not say hallelujah in their rooms in case a neighbor hears and reports them and then they find themselves locked up sometimes for years and some even die in incarceration i know as a church we're committed to doing what we can for the persecuted church but let's encourage ourselves to do even more Well, that's all from me this week. Here's a recap of all the announcements you've heard today. For more information, please do go onto the website. It's www.jesushouse.org.uk. And of course, we are so very social. Our handles are always at Jesus House UK and at Jesus House London. We're on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and of course, YouTube. Until next time, have a beautiful week. Bye.